Hi guys, it's Inamika4 here with the HTC One. Now when HTC first released this device, it shipped with Android 4.11, but they did advise an update would soon be available for Android 4.22 Jellybean. And as you can see here, I'm rocking Android version 4.1.2. It's now mid-July 2013, and HTC have come true to the word because my system has downloaded an update. So it's just over 400 meg, and it says it's for Android 4.2. So here we go. This is what you get. It's done all the updates and now it's upgrading the 50 or so applications on there. So we'll let us do this thing before we do anything else. So it's finished upgrading application, so let's swipe in. That's updating the widgets. Let's have a quick look. Look at the update already to the way that was before. You got the toggles back, brilliant. So if we go to settings, about software version. Ooh, look, congratulations, your phone has been updated successfully to version 2.24.401.1. So we hit OK to that, have a look at the software information and have a look at that Android version 4.2.2. So let's take a look at what's new in this update and if I swap down from the notifications area it kind of looks to be the same as before to be honest but notice the cog isn't there for the settings. If I tap on that it displays the toggles, the 12 or so toggles that you can turn settings on and off from. So single swipe notifications area, two finger swipe, the toggles are displayed. And notice I've activated Google now accidentally and that should be done via the home button so holding it down and then swiping up opens up Google now and double tap should take into the recent applications as it does there so we'll just two finger swipe to go to the settings and another option here if I go to display should be the option for daydream where the phone's docked or you can tell it when to daydream essentially when it's charging or when it's docked or either one of those at all and what it essentially does is this just daydreaming colors moving around that type of thing and if we come out of this go back again further down there you've got the option there for the home button if you want it to uh, double tap to go into google now or swipe from then onwards so if we go further down under power we should also have an update to display the percentage of the battery yes we do just there so you've got the notifications area displaying the percentage of the battery there and if we go back to the home screen here the widgets have also been overhauled so if I tap on that you can swipe across the, the top and scroll through the widgets from this location here so we go back to the home and there also should be some new lock screen widgets so if we go to settings personalize and then go to lock screen style then settings you can see some of the widgets there as well i've also read that photosphere should be included on this android 4.2.2 update but i've loaded up the camera application and i've checked out all the settings that are available within the, the settings menu in the top left of the screen here but there's no options that i can see whatsoever for photosphere being enabled on this update for the htc one so let me know in the comment section down below if i'm being totally dim and miss the setting completely and that's how the android jelly bean 4.2.2 two updates been applied to the HTC one here in the UK completely stuck no route required and rolled out by the manufacturer themselves and taking a quick look at some of the new features included as part of that new update as well and as ever any comments or questions you guys have got hit them up in the comment section down below there give us a thumbs up if you like this video and a lot what you saw and if you haven't already done so hit subscribe it's also down there as well doesn't cost you a penny and you can also check out some of our forthcoming videos thanks for watching have a wicked day and we'll see you next time